Hello guys! Good evening! Welcome back to my channel. So, today po, I decided nakakain ako ng pansit. And, um, of course, I can make baong tomorrow also. So, let me show you what are the ingredients that I'm gonna use to my pansit. Okay, guys! Guys, I have my onion and garlic and a little bit ginger because I already marinated my uh, chicken. So I use with a little bit chili, salt, cornstarch, soy sauce, and it's, it's called great Graham Masala. I just found it in the grocery. It's a mix of it, spices. And then I have my cabbage. I have my carrots and I have my red pepper. So those are the ingredients that I'm gonna use it with my pancet. Pancet and then I'm gonna mix it with canton. So this guys I already put a uh, butter on the pan and then after that I'm gonna put my onion. Oops. So para po hindi siya masunog yung butter, ilagay na natin yung onion. So, medyo dadamihan ko po yung pansip ko para meron ng pambaon. And I promise to Ate Marlene that I'm gonna bring her when I cook again. So, but today I will mix it with canton. So, I hope she will love it. And of course, I learned from the first pansip that I cooked because the time I put a little bit chili. So, now I'm gonna remove that one. And I hope that I did more better right now. So, wait lang po natin siyang mag-transparent uh, yung onion. And then, of course, I'm gonna uh, put the garlic and the ginger. So, the ginger, not, uh, I just put it po, pa, sorry, para mawala yung lensa ng chicken. But, just a little bit. Just now, um, medyo transparent na yung onion. And then, I'm gonna put a garlic and then ginger together. So, para sabay po silang maluto. Yeah. And, guys, I just uh, have the butter. So I'm not putting much uh, oil, so I just use more butter to give more taste. So I am a butter lover. Yes, I love more butter than cooking oil. So wait na po natin mag-brown yung garlic and then after that we will put our demarinated chicken. So. I just saw this one from the YouTube and that they did the marinated. It's a different version of uh, pancet. It's a different flavor, so why I would not try? So maybe it's more tasty, you know, so at least uh, we can take some other flavor from the pancet. But of course, it's still a Filipino version. I just only marinated the chicken before I'm gonna gisa all the ingredients. Or before I'm gonna gisa the chicken, I just marinated first. So it's just half a teaspoon only for, for the marinated chicken, half a teaspoon of salt, cornstarch, um, soy sauce, chili powder, and um, Graham masala. So I just saw the Graham masala in the grocery and that's the, I think, mix of spices that one. And I think it tastes good because I tried it last time and my sister, she loved it as well. But the only difference from the previous um, concept that I cooked, it was really spicy because I add more chili powder on on the sauce. So now I'm gonna remove that just only from the marinated chicken. So as you can see guys, the garlic is a bit more brown now. So now I can uh, put my marinated chicken. So it is a natin siya. So I think this chicken is about like 500 grams. So it is a natin siya until ma brown or until lumambot siya ng konti. And then we can add our some other ingredients. So cover lang po natin siya. By the way guys, naglagay na pala ako ng chicken broth. So, hindi pa ako nagpakulo ng chicken. Um, naglagay lang pa ako ng isang nor cube, one nor cube chicken sa isang bowl. Tapos, yan na po siya. And then after that, lagyan na natin siya ng soy sauce. And then, tikman natin kung okay na yung lasa. And then, kapag okay na po, we can just put our, the rest of the ingredients like, um, carrots, cabbage, and pepper. Okay, guys? So, guys, malambot na yung chicken. Nilagay ko na po yung soy sauce at the same time. And nilagay ko na yung carrots. And then, guys, now, ilalagay ko na yung cabbage. Yan. So, iya-half-cook lang po natin yung vegetable. Kasi mas masarap yung medyo half-cook lang. Yan po. 
And then, yung pepper, yung black pepper or yung red pepper. Medyo late ko siya lalagay kasi mabilis lang siyang maruto. So, kung gusto niyo din, pwede niyo na siyang isabay. Yan guys. And then, haluin lang natin siya. Haluin lang po. So, tinikman ko na po yung sauce niya. Tamang-tama lang. So guys, pakukuluan lang natin siya. Takpan muna natin siya kahit mga 3 minutes lang. Natin siyang pakukuluan. And then, ilalagay ko na yung red pepper. And then, after that, yung pansit. Pansit bihon and yung pansit kanto. So, ayan, kumukulo na. And it's time for the red pepper. Ilagay. Ayan po. So, i-gigisa lang natin siya within 1 minute. Kasi mabilis naman pumaluto yung red pepper natin. So, pampagandang kulay and pampadagdag lasa. Yung, yung red pepper po kasi, they call it a baby pepper. It's matamis siya. So, ang sarap niya kahit sa salad niya siya ilagay. Okay, guys? So, guys, nalagay ko na po yung pansit bihon and then yung pansit canton. So, imimix ko lang po siya until ma-absorb ng pansit yung, yung sauce niya. And then, kapag na-absorb na po ng canton yung sauce, in a few minutes, ready na siya. Okay, guys? And then, take him ng portion! Guys, na-absorb na yung, yung pansit kanton yung sauce niya. So, mga 2 to 3 minutes, and then, take him ng portion na ito. It's look nice na po siya. Ang bango-bango niya. Promise. So, guys, ayan, ito na po siya. So, titikman na natin siya. So, gusto ko po sa pansit is medyo may sauce ng konti. Hindi yun super dry. Kasi po, para mas malasya siya. So, tikman na natin guys. So, guys, ayan na. Tiki man portion. Ito ang pinakamasaya after mo magluto. Yung titikman mo yung niluto mo. Ayan. So, we'll see. Tamang-tama lang po yung lasa. At, at ano siya ba guys? Habang kinakain mo yung gulay, naririnig mo pa yung crunchiness. So, ibig sabihin, meron pa siyang mga vitamins, nutrients na na makukuha sa gulay. So, as I told you earlier, I love to have a bit um, half-cooked vegetables. So, yun yung the best thing. So, well guys, if you like the video, please don't forget to like and subscribe and share the video. So, have a blessed night and thanks for watching. I have to go to my sister to deliver the pansit that I cook. Bye! Hello guys! Nakapag-deliver na po ako ng pansit sa ate ko. And exchange daw kami. She cook uh, sopas, o diba? Nakalain mo yon. So, tawag magbibigay ako. May kapalit! So, bibilisan ko na po yung lakad para makakain na din ako at makapag-rest. So, thank you guys again for watching. And, thank you then kasi kati paano nasisihan kayo sa kakulitan ko. Okay guys, have a blessed evening again. And please don't forget to like and subscribe and share the video. Good night everyone!